Uh, we are playing, you'll see in a minute, Story of Seasons, Friends in Mineral Town. Okay. Uh, this is in 2021. Uh, we are a girl. We're gonna go with... This one? Yes. Uh, let's change your name. B. Their day is, we're technically a kind of a winter birthday. Because it's not kind of spring yet. Uh, we're gonna have to go simple. Start with a lot of gold items, sell for more gold. Easier to raise affection with people. Start with 18 turnips in the field. Normal mode is none of the features. Offers satisfaction. We're gonna go simple mode for now. Just because I don't know how to play. One day a special letter arrived in my mailbox. It was sent from a person who introduced himself as the mayor of a certain little town. The moment I finished reading it, oops, I dropped my controller. The moment I finished reading the letter, I packed up my things and headed for the train station. Once there, I bought a ticket. A ticket to Mineral, Mineral Town, the place where my grandfather had his farm. Day. You are B, I presume. I'm Thomas. It's, it is my great honor to preside over Mineral Town as its mayor. Here it is. This is the land your grandfather left to you. I'm afraid it's been some time since anyone attended to it, so it's fallen into a bit of despair. Do you remember when you came here as a child? You spent a summer together with your grandfather. We're gonna have a monologue? I'm sorry, B. We had to cancel our family vacation this summer. I just couldn't get the time off for it. There's something very important that I have to do at work, and I can't leave. I'm really sorry, but you'll have to make do without a trip this year. Things are just too busy. I promise I'll make it up to you. I'm so sorry, B, but please understand. We may not get a family vacation, but we have asked your grandfather to let you stay with him at his farm this summer. His farm is wonderful. It's surrounded by nature with all sorts of places to explore. You can relax and play as much as you like. We've already packed your things. All that's left is to go and have fun. Oh ho, there you are, B. Do you remember me? I'm your grandpa. There ain't too much to do out here in the sticks, but go have a nosy round if you like. I'm afraid I'll be busy most of the day doing my chores around the farm, so I won't have much time to play with you. <laughs> trying to do my typical southern. There are, like, really draw it out. There are a few kids around your age in town, though. I'm sure they'll let you play with them. So go on and introduce yourself. I am on a cow. I am off the cow. Horse. That horse has a big, long nose. And I know horses normally do, but... Oh my god, the chickens. Fishing. Who are you? What? Oh, it's a kid. Oh yeah, someone said the old guy at the farm down the road was having a visitor from the city. That must be her. I wonder what she's doing all by herself. Do you always play alone? Wow, me too. I like this place a lot, so I came here all the time. Hey, why don't you tell me about yourself and the city and stuff? What's it like there? Well, B, how do you like the country life? Was it fun? When you get back home, say hello to your mom and dad for me. Let them know I enjoyed having you come visit. Aw, are you all going already? Oh, I'll miss you. You'll be coming back someday, though, right? Promise me you'll come back. It's been 20 years since then. I see you've grown into a fine young adult. 
Your grandfather loved this little farm dearly, you know. I'm sure it would make him oh so happy to know that you have inherited it. Well, what do you say? Would you like to give farming a try? <laughs> I could say no. Yeah. Excellent, excellent. Allow me to be the first to welcome you as a new resident of Mineral Town. Now then, as you are the new owner of this farm, do you not think a new name is in order? Uh, we're gonna call it Honey Grove. Or Honey Farm. Honey Oat Farms. We have Honey Grove on the island. Honey, honey Oat Farm. Hmm. It does have a nice ring to it. Running a farm is not the easiest of gr jobs in the world, but if you try hard, I'm sure you will do your grandfather proud. Well, I'm sure you must be tired from your long trip here. Why don't you rest for a remainder of the day? I must return to my duties as mayor. I bid you good evening. Okay. Tomorrow my new life as a farmer begins. Oh, look at us. A pop up. Examine. Table. Am I right to assume it? Right in assuming this is the first time you've ever worked on a farm. Please allow me to offer you some advice. Oh dear. Okay, there we go. To talk to a person standing... Standing in front of you or lift objects next to you, press the confirm button. Next, use an item. Make certain to equip it first, then press the tool button and to use it. And when you need to do a bit of shopping, go to the store, stand across from the counter sh from the shopkeeper and talk to them. However, if, they're, if the store is closed, you can still speak to the shopkeeper, but you won't be able to buy anything. There are several other controls available to you as well. Would you like for me to explain them? Yes. Alright, would you like me to know more about? Uh, tending livestock. There are lots of animals in Mineral Town. Raise them with love and you will gain much from them. There are five different types of animals you can raise. Cows, sheep, alpacas, chickens, and angora rabbits. Cows, sheep, and alpacas live in barns. Chickens and angora rabbits live in coops. You can purchase a new animal from a store or breed your current animals and raise the babies. It is important to feed your animals every day, brush them, talk to them, and put them out to pasture on nice days. The more love you show them, the better byproducts they will produce, so make sure to take good care of them. Uh, Mineral Town. Your new life in Mineral Town has just begun. There are lots of interesting people living here and many shops that sell everything you need to begin your farm adventures. The nearby mountain is covered in nature's bounties, and it has the most wonderful view from its peak. As a new farmer, you can try all sorts of things, raising crops and livestock for foraging and mining for items and more. If you're not sure what to, where to start, try talking to the townsfolk and seeing what advice they give you. We hope you enjoy your wonderful new life as a farmer in this beautiful little town. Okay, I guess this... To grow crops, first you must till the land with a hoe. Equip a hoe and press the toll button. Ah, uh, we're good. We're just... This is your farm, after all. You may do, it with... do with it as you wish. Though I may recommend focusing on earning a little money first to make a life a touch easier. There are many things in the forest that you can forge and ship for a little pocket change, for example. And once your daily chores are finished, I suggest strolling, taking a stroll around town I mean a local residence. If you follow the road from your farm to the right, you will find your neighbors. I'm sure they'd be happy to chat or give advice. Oh yes, one last thing. When you return home, check your toolbox. Inside you'll find a little gift. It's just my old pedometer. But I think you'll get some use out of it. Pedometer. <laughs> I always do that. Mineral Town is a large place, after all. 
uh, it might be interesting how many steps you've walked. Now then, that ought to do for today. I'll drop by and see how you're doing again. Good luck. Mm. Come on, let me play. Yo, I'm Zach. I handle all the shipping around these parts. Nice to meet you. When you're farming, there's one big thing you gotta remember, yeah? Here, I'll show you. See this? This is your shipping bin. Don't forget about it. You want to sell something? You put it in the bin. I come by at 5 p.m. every day to pick them up. Whatever's in there. When I do, I automatically add your cut of the sale to your wallet. Nifty, right? Oh, but I don't come by to collect on holidays or festival days. You know, you want to know why? Because I want days off too, darn it. Yeah. Ha ha ha. Uh, anyway. This ain't your only shipping bin. There's one inside the coop and barn, too. You can sell crops and you've harvested or stuff you're foraged from the mountains. Oh, and stuff like eggs, milk, and wool can go in there, too. You get the idea, right? Okay, now, listen up. This is important. Working hard is a grain and all, but don't overdo it. If your face starts going blue, that's a sign you're about to kill over. When you get that bad, don't push it. Just go on rest, all right? Nobody wants a vacation to the clinic. Got all that? Good. I'll be stopping by 5 p.m. then. See ya. Yes, I would like to work, though. Pick. That's a... That's a... I just stole honey. Pick. Two bucks. Okay. Picking those up. Well, obviously these could go in there. Okay, thank you for telling me. Okay, but I need a tool. I need to water. Oh. Ah, oh, okay. Oh, I need water. Okay. I water the plants. This is definitely weird. And I wasn't ready to fish, but now I'm kind of curious. Juice fish take out. I don't have any. No box. God's come to God's workshop to renovate your home or farm. Materials and furniture are also available. Uh, ain't never been any good at this kind of thing. Basically, I got stuff you might need, seeing as you just moved here and I'll drop by sometime. Chickens? Do I already got chickens? No, I don't already got chickens. Sadness. Well, this is not what I thought it would be as easy as I thought. Like, I literally can just pick them up. Okay, what time is it? 3 p.m.? Okay, we go to, we're gonna have to go to town. Okay, let's, 
let's let's horse. I need a horse. Cows. Uh, I just gotta figure out how to head to town. That's why I assume. Oh, there he goes. Hi, it's me, Counter. Uh, you're an unfamiliar face around these parts. Ah, so you're new to caretake of the, you're the new caretaker of the farm, I see. It must be difficult to manage a farm with only one set of hands, but do your best out there. Thank you, Sabara. I forgot to introduce myself. The name's Sabara. Nice to meet you. Thank you. What's this? Empty pot. I just went into the woods. <laughs> Whose house is this? Hello, puppy. Hello, H Hannah. You sure are a cheerful, cheerful pup. Oh, you're so you're B. My name's Moogie or Muggy. Nice to meet you. Hi there, lady. You a traveler? Hey, ma uh, hey, May. What? You moved on to that farm? Me? I live on one too. I'm May. Nice to meet you. Someone might be upstairs. I didn't think of that. Now, no, no going up there, please. Okay. My bad. I didn't realize we were selective on where we go. Well, there's the bulletin board. Oh boy, am I not gonna remember where I am? Squish, 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 squish. It's locked. Hello. Uh, I want to be friends. Everyone's like shutting down. I just wanted to, hi. You're the new gal who moved into that farm down the way, right? Ah, so your name is B? I'm Rick. I live in town with my mom and my little sister, Popuri. Popuri? It's good to meet you. Hello, Rick. Oh god, Rick, you trapped me. Yeah, thanks. Protis appreciate it. I did not mean to give you that, actually. That doesn't sound good. I don't know how to get home. Okay. Yes. Okay, we got 648. Oh, we instantly had food. That's nice. Good morning. I'm sorry to disturb you at this early hour. Huang? Ah, I humbly apologize. I have not introduced myself. I'm Huang, a traveling merchant. I have just arrived in this town. It is honor to meet you. I see you have a farm, yes? As it so happens, I m have many seeds for sale. Rare seeds, unique seeds. Come see my wares, buy them. Mr. Zack has generously allowed me to stay at his home. I have opened my store there. Come whenever you like. I always, always welcome new customers. Okay, now I must go and greet the other customers in town. Goodbye. Okay. I simply must, uh, water. Well, 
my plants first. Like these are my chores on this farm first. I, I, oops. I would like a chicken. We're just gonna go straight into town. What's this? This looks like a market. It's locked. Closed on Saturdays, 10 a.m., 12 p.m. Well, you should be opening soon. It's locked. Just don't say anything. Hello? Why are you running? Oh, hello. Are you a resident here? I don't believe I've heard your name. Ah, B, is it? I'm Jennifer. A pleasure. You were running fast, Jennifer. Like, booking it. What is this? Ah, you're B, yes? A most... Uh, meaning indeed. Thomas told me all about you. My name's Carter and I am the town priest. I hope to see you at church. Okay. I don't remember that ever being a thing before. Hello. A friend was just telling me about how somebody moved into that old farmhouse. So that's you, huh? You're B. Got it. I'm Karen. Pleasure's all mine. Yeah, that makes me worried. This is a doctor. I got something amazing to show you, Ellie. You do, do you? Well, don't keep me in suspense. Get a load of this. Oh, for goodness sake. How many times have I told you that this is a sterile environment? That means no bugs, ever. <laughs> if you keep scowling, you're going to turn into a wrinkled old lady. Oh, what? what did you just say? And where do you think you're going for that matter? Get back here this instant. Oh, you're not from this town, are you? I'm so sorry about all this. You're B, the one who came to work on the farm, right? The whole town has been a buzz ever since your arrival. Oh, I bet they have. My name is Ellie. I'm the nurse at this clinic. It's a pleasure to meet you. And speaking of seeing, Stop hiding behind B and look me in the eye, you. Fine, you meanie. Ugh, he's a natural born prankster, I swear. All I did was show you a bug. You know I hate insects. That's why I keep bringing them to you. It's so you'll get over it. Ugh, you always have a comeback for everything. Who did you learn that from, I wonder? You understand how I have failed, don't you? Yeah, Tully, what's bugging her? You shouldn't harass people. Yeah, Tully, what's bugging her? I knew you would. You and me are going to be best buds, I can tell. Yeah, I like bugs. Oh, she's mad. Honestly, you. Please don't encourage him, B. He'll only use it as an excuse to wreck more havoc. I'm sorry, but you should appreciate bugs more. Please don't go upstairs. Well, excuse me. You yelled at me, but you were nowhere nearby. It's in this house. I just want to say hello. Let me in. Why does no one want to be my friend? Open the doors. I'm friendly, I promise. Hey, who are you? Wait, come back. Did he just... Hello? Hmm, who are you? Huh, so you're the new caretaker of that farm. I'm Duke, nice to meet you. I just chased him in the basement and I feel like that was a really bad idea. Hi. My, my, my. I haven't seen you around before. 
Could you be B? Bingo, I just knew it. I heard from Thomas that someone was new was moving to town and he may or may not let your name slip too. Hmm, me. Oh, where are my manners? My name is Mana. My husband Duke and I run this vineyard. It's ever so nice to meet you. We may be out in the boonies, but the folks here are kind, so let us know if you're ever in bind. Oh, I'm a poet. Oh, whoops. Am I talking too much? I'm so sorry. Bad habit. Okay. Can I go upstairs though? Oh, you let me. That's a first. Wow. That's the first time I was allowed upstairs. Hello? Basil. Greetings, you're a sightseer. Wait, you say you moved to this town? Nature's bounty is abundant here, quite unlike the lifeless air of large cities, so I'm sure you'll love it here. Hmm, <laughs> me? Oh, that's right. Introductions, I'm Basil. And an enthusiast of all things botanical, I study plants here in Mineral Town. Nice to meet you. Hello there, goodness. We haven't met before, have we? Ah, oh, so you're the one who just moved into that farm. Speaking of which, I seem to recall Thomas mentioning something along those lines. My name is Anna. I hope you'll come and enjoy life in our cozy little town. Okay, but, 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 but. Hi. Oh, goodness me, a new face. You're B. Hmm. I'm Ellen. It's a pleasure to meet you. Oh, my legs. I have an illness that makes my muscles weak, so I've been chair bound for some time now. I'm just at that age. Oh, Ellen. Hi, I miss Mac Farms a lot. That makes me sad. Hello, Mayor. My, my, if it isn't B. Good day. How fair is the farm? Is all going well? I want to buy stuff. When does this open? Oh, it's closed on Tuesdays. Dang it. Oh, well, that's a bummer. And a half. Why? Hmm, now what am I gonna do with this? It'd be a waste to just toss it. Yo, B, good timing. I was just wondering what I should do with this thing. See, an old buddy of mine moved in and left his fishing rod behind. Me, I don't fish. So I was wondering what to do with this darn thing. Still in good shape, so it'd be a shame to junk it. What do you say, B? Want it? I got an inkling that you got a talent for fishing. You got a fishing rod. To fish, equip the fishing rod and press the tool button to catch the fishing, the cast fishing line straight in front of you. Once the line is cast, simply sit back and wait for a fish to bite. When the fish bites, the baller will move violently. Press the tool button at the moment to reel in your fish. If the fish escapes, simply wait until the next fish comes along and bites. If your timing is off, you may only reel in an empty hook, but don't give up. Cast your line and try again. If there aren't any fish where you're fishing, no matter how long you wait, you won't get a bite. Try somewhere else. Different fish can be caught depending on where you fish and what season it is. Try fishing at various places and times. Sometimes you may even reel in a giant guardian class fish or rare items. Okay, thank you. Can I buy stuff? Ah, you got a good item, yes? You have gotten a good item, yes? I want to buy... Welcome, dear customer. Okay, that's a lot of money. Truth jewel. Gathering none of these will reveal the true state of being. Uh, let's get some pumpkin... Pink cat flowers. Well, obviously we want cabbage. We'll get some... I'm just kidding, we can't buy some. Um... You told a oh, poop. I'm full. Hmm. 
My pockets are full. Okay, let's go plant this. What is this? Can I go in here? Hi. Moo cow. The cows are always look so cute and happy. Hi. Hmm, hello, and you are? Mayor Thomas told us you're coming. I'm Sasha. My family runs General Store. I do hope you drop by every once in a while. My my, is there something I can help you with? Okay, but buy animals? Okay, I had enough money for a chicken at one point. Uh. Hmm, I don't think we've met. Well, hi, I'm Paul Free. What's your name? Ah, uh, B, huh? It's nice to meet you. I like pretty much everyone in this town except for Kai. Can't stand that no good bum. He drifts in like low tide in the summer and turns town on its head and disappears whenever he pleases. Ooh, Kai. There's some hatred gone for you. Scoot, scoot. Scoot, scoot. I'm trying to get home. I just wanted to go plant my stuff. Okay. Seeds! Oh, I didn't realize it was going to do stuff like that. Ooh. I didn't realize I was going to plant that much. Well, I'm going to have a crap ton of pumpkin seeds, I think it was. Okay, well, we've entered a new world of pumpkin. way too many I have way too many seeds now that one what don't got nothing for me today how about you try raising some chickens treat them right and they'll give you some fresh eggs every day I don't got money for chickens though right now I'm sorry I didn't do it correctly instead I bought 800 pumpkin seeds Because I realized that, you know, pumpkin seeds are my calling, apparently. Sometimes you just like pumpkin seeds. I like doing these little squares, though, because this is the perfect amount. Like, look at this. Perfect. It's all nice and tidy. Wonder how many how many days this said for the pumpkins? Uh oh. We're getting tired. Uh oh. Okay, maybe we should go to bed.
Okay, well. Uh, what's right in this? I am slightly curious if I can, like, water my last two plants. Because that kind of bothers me. Ugh. Yeah. Okay, now we're done. Writing journal. Okay. Okay, let's go to bed. Okay, and unfortunately we gotta stop here, so I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye!